My name is Jonathan Wong. I'm with the District 214 Robotics team, uh, which is based out of Arlington Heights, Illinois. So I'm here with uh, the high school students from the robotics team, and we're working on just kind of showing off the robot from 2016. They work with mentors and engineers around the area to build this robot and compete at the World Championship for FIRST Robotics. A lot of our students go off and actually study engineering once they leave our team, uh, and they come back and actually mentor or help you know, give back to the team once they're out of college or working in the industry. One of the unique things about this is that it, it counts as a class, or robotics class, so the students actually learn a lot of the mechanical uh, workings of how robotic systems work. They learn how to code, program, and work together to actually manufacture and build these robots and understand how some of the manufacturing processes work. And that's really what the major draw of our program is. It's giving kids that real life experience that they could take and actually apply to something that you know, they could have fun doing and competing in, but also taking away some real life, real working you know, skills. Um, a lot of the kids walk away you know, with uh, a lot of enthusiasm for the program and just this uh, drive to keep learning and working. And I'm Jasper Pasternak. Uh, I'm a senior at H Prospect High School, and uh, I'm on the mechanical sub team for Team 111 Wild Stang. We build robots, and um, I'm the lead, one of the lead mechanical students. I was the main uh, guy who was in charge of the design of the shooter and how we uh, went about attacking that challenge. It's amazing that we could come out and uh, show show our robot and uh, see what show them what we can do and see what uh, we can hopefully do in the future when we graduate. My name is Becky Reich. I am a senior at Rolling Meadows High School and I am looking forward to going to college at Case Western or Gonzaga University. The function that I did on the robot was programming the different functions as such in order to make the robot work. It's inspiring to see how what we're doing can become applicable to something later on. One of the things that Wild Sang Team 111 does as a team is we have about 70 or so kids on our team and we separate those 70 or so kids in different sub teams which focus on different categories of the robot to complete and all those categories will come together. Specifically the sub teams that we have or the major ones are mechanical, electrical and software. The mechanical sub team does all the gear ratios. They go on CAD and they design the robot. Electrical goes through wiring. They make sure that the motors and the servos and the victors and everything is hooked up and wired correctly. They have to work very closely with the mechanical to make sure that they have enough space and room for everything to function correctly. Software, like in the name, goes out and programmatically makes sure that the robot does autonomous, drives correctly, and just functions and makes sure that it does what we need it to do to complete the competition.